Good afternoon, I'm Karen Larson. Here are your top stories in green country this afternoon. The owner of Tulsa's Cookie Monster Bakeries is accused of stealing about $2,200 worth of baking ingredients from a local Sam's Warehouse store. An affidavit says Libby Morley's thefts were first noticed on November 2nd and that they stretch back to October 8th. Morley, who just opened a location in the Mother Road Market, tells us it's a misunderstanding. Tulsa arson investigators are looking for two suspects accused of starting a fire at an apartment complex. It's believed they started the fire in a doorway at the London Square complex near 51st and Lewis. If you recognize them or you have any information about this crime, call police. And the Tulsa Police Department's special operations team left for the 11th annual warrior competition in Jordan today. The eight man team is going to compete in fitness and shooting tests. The competition runs from April 14th to the 21st. Union Public Schools Renegade Regiment got some very exciting news today. They're going to perform in the 2020 Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade in New York City, representing Oklahoma. This is the second appearance by the band. The first time was in 2013. Very cold for tomorrow morning, a freeze warning in southeast Kansas. Overnight lows from the upper 20s to the lower 30s and portions of eastern Oklahoma, a frost advisory for tomorrow morning. Tomorrow afternoon, 62 and partly cloudy with an increasing chance for rain moving in by Saturday afternoon all the way through Sunday morning, a cool weekend, then warming back on up into the 70s for next week. Karen? All right, thank you, Brandon. Be sure to join us at 5 and 6 for your evening news, and you can find more news on our app and website, kjrh.com.